There are three main techniques for reducing the risk from tropical storms, prediction, protection and planning. Prediction is attempting to forecast when and where a natural hazard will strike and is done using current knowledge and monitoring techniques. Tropical storms can be monitored using weather and satellite images. In the North Atlantic, there are two levels of warnings issued by the National Hurricane Center in Miami. Hurricane Watch, which advises that hurricane conditions are possible, and Hurricane Warning, which advises that hurricane conditions are expected and that people should take immediate action, such as evacuating to high ground or taking shelter. Protection is taking action before a hazard strikes to reduce its impact. There are many ways this can be done for tropical storms. Windows, doors and roofs can be reinforced to strengthen buildings to withstand strong winds. Storm drains can be constructed in urban areas to take away excessive amounts of rainfall and prevent flooding. Sea walls can be built to protect properties from storm surges. Houses close to the coast can be constructed on stilts so that a storm surge can pass underneath. In Bangladesh, nearly 2,000 cyclone shelters have been built. They are constructed of concrete as it is strong and long-lasting. There are shutters over the windows to protect against high winds and flying debris during storms. They are built on stilts which reduces the damage caused by flooding. They are also built on raised ground to keep them out of storm surge waters. There are stairs to allow easy access to the building. Bicycles can be used to take warnings to remote areas. And finally, the shelters are used as community centres, schools and medical centres for most of the time. Planning is taking action to enable communities to respond to and recover from hazards. Evacuation plans are used in areas where storms are likely and protection from storms is difficult, such as low-lying land. Education of local people helps prevent deaths or injuries during storms. The US runs National Hurricane Preparedness Week and families in the US are encouraged to form their own action plan in case of hurricanes. I mentioned Bangladesh earlier with the cyclone shelters but it's also a good example to talk about as it has significantly reduced the effects of tropical storms. Cyclones are tracked by the Bangladesh Meteorological Department. Warnings are issued over radio, TV and on social media. Remote rural areas are also warned by volunteers using bikes. All of this effort has caused the average number of deaths by tropical storms to decrease from 500,000 in 1970 to just 4,000 in 2010.